In order to publish the record in DNS, we would need to have access to DNS for our domain. Um, and that will depend where your domain is registered. It may depend where your name servers are hosted. Uh, for this example, we're just going to be going into GoDaddy because that is where uh, our example domain happens to be registered. So I'm going to sign in there real quick. So in GoDaddy, where the domain is registered for moderndigitaloffice.com, we're going to go in and create a text record to publish this SPF record in DNS. So uh, depending on where your domain is hosted, the setup may be slightly different, but it's pretty much the same thing uh, in, most, uh, in most DNS configurations. So here we're going to add a new record. I'm going to make sure that that record is of type text. Uh, in this case, we're going to make the host at because it's not on a subdomain, it is on the main domain. And the text value is going to be that SPF record that we created. Paste that in there. TTL, we're going to leave it one hour, which is pretty standard. We'll save that. And then as soon as that record, as soon as that update to our DNS propagates across the internet, then we would start seeing a possible improvement in uh, detection of things like phishing messages.